there. What? What's up, my NSAFs? Welcome to my channel. So today, I'm going to be reacting to Hell of a Boss Season 1, Episode 2, Lululand. Honestly, with this show, who the hell knows what's going to happen. Uh, so I'm excited to get into it and most likely laugh my ass off. Before we get into it, though, I do have a very special announcement to make because this video is sponsored by Atlas VPN. So for those of you wondering what a VPN is, a VPN is a virtual private network, which basically just routes all of your internet activity through a secure and encrypted connection. So basically, it protects you from one wandering eyes on the internet that are trying to view and or monitor your activity on the internet. Not that you're doing anything that you wouldn't want people to be watching. Right? It blocks all the malicious links, ads, and trackers and notifies you when someone is trying to steal your data. Most of my work is done on the internet, so uh, I do personally appreciate the security. And I especially like that if my email account has been breached or anything like that, Atlas VPN actually lets you know if and where your email account has been breached. Searching up something on Google that you don't want other people looking at? You know, stuff like bunnies. And you can actually search the web with real and organic search results and you can do it without it tracking your activity. Which is great because I personally don't want Google tracking my searches on corn. <laughs> and on top of all that good stuff, one of my favorite perks is that you can unlock content from around the world. So let's say you live in the United States, well you're only going to be able to watch the specific shows that Netflix has available for your region. As you can see here, I'm in the United States, oh look, I have these show options. Now all of a sudden we're just going to go over to London, hello love, and look at that. Now I have more shows I can watch. I don't I don't know what that accent was. And if you're like me, you like watching your content on your phone, on your laptop, on your computer, on your TV, well, Atlas VPN actually protects you on unlimited devices. You want it on your phone? Check. You want it on your laptop? Check. You want it on your TV? Check. You want it on your toilet? Check. So if you want to check this out, Atlas VPN is offering the sweet, sweet deal. If you click that link in my description, you will get your account for just $1.70 per month plus six months free. This is a limited time offer, guys, so I would definitely get on it. Click that link, check them out. You're going to get access to all kinds of shows that you didn't have access to before. Your data, all of your online searches are going to be protected. You can have unlimited access on all your devices with just one account. And not to mention, if you're going to do a lot of online shopping, especially for the holidays, you'll also be able to see the best deals. So I would get on that if I were you and thank you so much Atlas VPN for sponsoring this video and now without any further ado let's get into it all right so here we go with the uh, Lululand <laughs> oh mm, Nivea is calling us Stella uh, you get up. Stop this. <laughs> I love Stella sorry sorry to pause right away but like I mean, we already knew he had, he has a wife and everything, but he has a kid too. We only knew this because like in the in the pilot, you know, when freaking Blitz stole, stole the book. He's like, I fucked your husband, sorry. So if this episode is more about Stolas, I'm gonna be happy because I've been kind of wanting to learn more about him anyway. So this should be interesting. What troubles you, my owlet? Daddy, daddy, I had a dream, a really bad dream. Oh. Hmm. I couldn't find you anywhere. Oh, he has a little girl. There. There, there, Via. It's okay. You're okay. Oh, how when you're cute. scared, no matter what happens to me, I will never be far away oh. from my special little starfire. Oh. It always seems more quiet. Oh. The... Oh my God, we're getting Sola singing. He's such a good dad. <laughs> he has some kinks. No doubt about that. But damn, he seems like a really good father, all. Silence grows under the moon. This is touching. What the fuck? I used to think love would be fun. Now oh. I, as the stars start to align. Oh my god. You take it as a sign. Like, I'm, my eyes are starting to water a little bit, actually. What the? Okay, hell of a boss is getting sensitive. All right, I like it. Not expected, but I like it. And if the seven rains go out, Ooh. The Sing it, Solace. You will be okay. When I'm gone, you'll be okay. When I'm gone, you'll be okay. Wait, why would you be gone? Ooh, okay. 
Ooh, the voice actor though! Nice pipes, bro. Damn. I'm impressed. <laughs> I'm downloading this song, I don't care. That was so nice. I'm like, uh, I'm literally like about to. she found out about Blitzy um because it sounds like she just found out okay so you're like a teenager now and now your parents are fighting because your dad slept with an imp and I'm assuming is very much in love with said imp considering his phone calls um okay poor girl <laughs> oh gosh poor kid I'm not spending another moment looking at your pathetic imp-sucking face! Oh, oh! <sighs> Good morning, Octavia. Did you speak Octavia. well, my That's not a serious question. <laughs> it's not a serious question. <laughs> Uh-oh. Pretty teenager time. Whoops. What's that you're listening to? This song is called My World is Burning Down Around Me. It's by Fuck You Dad. It's by Fuck You Dad! <laughs> oh, oh no! Oh, I hope their, their relationship gets mended first! I'm sorry, that was funny. I'm like gonna cry out of the humor. So, are you two done screaming for the day? Um, probably not. I haven't taken you. He squeaks. He squeaks like Charlie squeaks. This is why I love him. Oh my god, Charlie's my favorite in freaking well, other than Angel Dust in uh, a Has Been Hotel. And look at now, Stolas is a squeaker. I have a thing for the soft squeakies. They're just such cute characters. Why don't we go to Lululand? Lululand. I'm not five anymore. You always were so happy when I took you to Lululand. Shit, I don't have to be five to go to Disneyland. Shit, take me there anytime. I'm down. I'll arrange our security. Security for a theme park? We are rich and we're hot. People <laughs> want our hot. money and our bodies. Our oh, money, maybe. Speak for well. yourself, princess. Speak for yourself, princess. <laughs> oh, the confidence. Yeah, stole us. I'm calling the only man who can f me. What? Who can protect me? Mm -hmm. You know. <laughs> nice. Well, you're such a good boss. Yeah, I really want you, sir. Me too. Let's three way. <laughs> what? <laughs> Blitz's lines half the time are just him legitimately screaming. <laughs> number one, number two, really? You trying to have a threesome with your employees? He has a thing for Amelia Moxie, does he not? Like, they've kind of hinted at it already, but like, damn, you really do. Hang on, I gotta rewind a little because I didn't hear what Stolz was saying, but he's, he's just like, what? <laughs> what? Why, hello, my big dick to Blitzy. <laughs> what? Everyone, I have a special language when you're the one that's constantly actually. Oh my god, is that why he's the only one who bleeps when he speaks curse words because he actually doesn't like bad language? Stop, stop. Tell me that's not the case. That's hilarious. Look, I just had a chemical peel, so you'll have to find someone else's face to plant that feathered ass. <laughs> to plant that feathered ass. <laughs> Don't invite us to shit unless someone's gonna die. I'll pay you. Pay me what? Money. Money. Isn't that like the second or third phone he's already. Yeah, it's fine. Whatever. Lululand? Lululand? Lululand! Shut the fuck! Fucking Luna. I'm sorry. Also, what I was gonna say is I will never get used to Millie's voice. I had gotten comments last time saying, oh, you'll get used to it, it'll grow on you. No, I refuse to let it grow on me. It's not gonna grow on me. I don't like it. <laughs> I still don't like it. I love Octavia so far, though. Now remember. You're gonna protect him? That's how much taller he is next to you? No wonder he calls.
calls him his little imp. Dad. Do we have to? Okay, uh, hold on right there, sweetie. If you try fucking my little ass in that park, I swear to you, I'm so cute when you are serious. I'm literally gonna be sick. Oh. No comment. I can't. Oh, there's a baby. Wow, I haven't been to this place since I was a child. It hasn't changed a bit. Mm-mm. Mm -mm. I'm sorry. No. I can't. It's big, lovely. Jeez. That is deeply upsetting. Oh, come on. It's fun. You've never been here? She also seems like more aggressive, which is another thing. I'm just like, I feel like they changed, but I get it. I get it. Okay. Because apparently the original voice actress was also, is also the voice actress of Luna. So I understand why they did it. I just wish they would have at least tried to match it. Like Stolas sounds similar to the original voice actor. This was such a change. All right. I'm done now. Well, hey there. Ah, I'm Lulu. Welcome to Lulu Land. Where are you, Lulu? If y'all get hurt here, just try. Look at Blitz. <laughs> Look, why don't we go check out the rides? That chick's creepy, huh? Yeah, wait till her dad tries to fiddle your holes. Uh, what does that mean? That much for a novelty cup that you use one time? Yep. Because it's Lulu Land! Yep. Listen to your hoe, Mox. <laughs> Listen to your hoe, Mox. We gotta do my favorite ride! Oh, yeah? Which, which one? Oh, shit. <laughs> the lawsuit? That's what it was called? Ooh, funnel cakes. Oh, and infinite suffering. No, I love funnel cakes. Oh, and ice cream. Ugh. I can't eat any of them anymore, but uh, I love them. <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah, back up. You know, it's quite thrilling to see you on the job, Blitzy. Save it, bitch, I'm working. Save it, bitch, I'm working. <laughs> Not to mention, though, I mean, he acts like he can't stand Stolas, and yet he's actually doing a legitimate good job at protecting him, so it's like... I think you like him, Blitz, secretly, and I think you hate that you like him, but, you know, whatever. If you used to cry such tears of joy <laughs> Of joy? Show. You sure? Uh, no. I don't think that was joy. Uh-uh. I hate, I hate that, that fucking, fucking clown. clown. Oh, Blitzy! <laughs> it's me, the robotic Fizzerali! Oh, God. To bring you a wonderful show celebrating Lulu Land spelled with those to avoid loss. Spelled with those. Everything is beautiful in Lulu Land. Her ugly children holding hands in Lulu Land. That's messed up. The train has a train. I'm here to tell about a magical, fantastic place called Lulu Land. Wait a minute. That was Charlie's song from the one she sang in the in the pilot of Hasbun Hotel. I have a dream. I'm here to tell. No. Was that a nice little shout out? Cause I caught that. I don't really know what that thing is, but I want that thing. <sighs> Finally, some thing I can handle. I can't. It's fine. Ow! Strike one, little man. But I hit it. I think it's a knock over. I don't know what to tell you, buddy. It didn't go down. Wow. So Rigged. <laughs> Octavia's dying. Oh, oh, shit. Is that shoot it, shoot it. My sensor spot of air. I guess the kitties are still running away from you. Huh? <laughs> oh, it's silent now. Oh, so your name used to be Blitzo, but now you're, because you were a clown, but you you purposely make the O silent? Interesting. All right. Real or not, though, people love me. Does anybody love you? Solus. So no. Stole but I'm really good with guns now. Dance, bitch! Dance, bitch! <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, oh, no. It's even worse. Let me try. Shot. What a dick. Are you kidding me? You, you, you sharp at At least he let her have it. Oh, no, never mind. Don't do that. Sir? Oh, hey, guys. Probably go, uh, thanks for stolas. Oh, it's all on fire. Ooh. Oh, what a mouth. <laughs> he caught himself. Oh, shit. Um... I think I'm supposed to be bodyguarded right now. 
Oh, nicely done. Oh. Octavia. Oh. I'm sorry, sweetie. I, I thought you loved it here. When I was a kid and my parents didn't hate each other. Mm. My dad didn't feel like it was a weird red dickhead the entire time. That's fair. I'm sorry. Mm. I just want to go home. But home doesn't even feel like home anymore. Oh. You ruined it. Your mother and I, I just, I felt she's always been, I haven't been, mm, ha mm, hard to explain. We went in, are you going to run off with him and leave me behind? Oh. Go away where I can't find you? He won't do that. No, 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 never. Dude, leave him alone. Oh, you can petrify people? Oh, shit! What would you like to do now? Oh, can we go to Stylish or Coles? They sell mm. weird taxidermy there. Hmm, okay. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, oh, that's cute. Nice. You're ruining another good thing, sir. <laughs> Worth it. That slutty toy clown has it. Millie! <laughs> Wait, where did Millie go? Oh god, okay, that was great. Wow, that was, I mean, it had its it its hilarious and inappropriate moments for sure. But that was actually a lot more touching and sweeter than I was expecting out of a hell of a boss episode. That was pretty good. And I like that we get to learn a little bit more about uh, Stolas and his family. I, I still fucking love Stolas and his daughter is adorable now. And yeah, I'm just kind of intrigued now to see uh, who else we get to learn about and where the story goes. This is this is good. I like it and it's funny as hell. Uh, pun intended. So thank you again to Atlas V. VPN. If you guys want to check it out, make sure you click that link in the description. Don't forget to like, subscribe for more videos. Go ahead and check me on my social media accounts where I post art and other cool stuff. If you want to see the full version of this reaction, go ahead and click that Patreon link down below. I thank you guys so much for tuning in, and I'll see you next time. Bye!